Welcome back. Our sports extra night continues with more high school football. Fairmont Cardinals welcome the Waseca Blue Jays to town for the Battle of the Birds. First quarter, Blaze Geiger drops back over to the middle to Levi Pooley for a first down. Cardinals move downfield fast. Waseca looks to stop the momentum. They do when Tostin Root goes unblocked, meets Geiger in the backfield for the tackle for loss. Later in the first, Fairmont with the ball. Geiger drops back and through the hands of Carter Ellis, who had a sure pick six. Cardinals very next play, taking advantage of the drop. It's Geiger to Pooley. Nobody is going to catch him. A 68-yard touchdown. Cardinals get on the board first as the seniors do the damage on this play. The Cardinals blank the Blue Jays 21-0 in this one. We have some nine-man football up next. Grenada Huntley East chain Truman Jaguars facing the Medelia Blackhawks. Eric Anderson trying to make something happen in the second quarter. Has a good run, but is stripped of the football by Carter Brudelli, recovered by Keegan Burhow. He takes it back a decent way for the return. The Jaguars look to add on already up big. Quarterback Jackson Madison looks to make something happen after he gets flushed out of the pocket. He'll air this one out. Anderson tries to make a play for the INT, but can't drag the toes long enough. Incomplete. The Jaguars win big in this one over Medelia. Now heading over Nicollet, the Raiders are hosting the Cedar Mountain Cougars. The Raiders cheer squad having some fun tonight. Nicollet under pressure, looking to make a pass downfield, but it's intercepted by Cedar Mountain's Blake Steffel, who makes it to the 50-yard line before getting stopped by the Raiders' defense. The Cougars wasting no time after the interception. Cooper Freitag gets the wheels going here, dodging defenders and running it straight into the end zone for the TD. With a good two-point conversion, the Cougars lead 15-0. Cougars get a hand on the ball on the football. It's deflected up and it's Parker Kirkhoff who gets the interception. Cedar Mountain all gas, no breaks. That's Freitag's fourth touchdown of the night and it's not even halftime yet. Cougars keep rolling and win it 49 to 13. And the play of the night this week goes to Mankato East Nathan Bridger with a pick six in the East versus West game. Make sure to vote for this week's play of the night after tonight's show. Hey, we have some pretty good candidates, man. Kill West, Jalen Smith. That's my early bias, but I, I shot that one. So, so. Yeah, you were there. You got to see it in real life. Yeah, I know uh -huh. Allie's going to be mm -hmm. voting probably for the Pearson catch, which can't go wrong with any of them. I mean, they're, they're all pretty great. Both great, great That'll plays. do it for this week's edition of Sports Sex. We'll be back next week on Tuesday.